All right, so look, man. Comedian just hilarious. Who, in my opinion, actually isn't that hilarious. But she is pretty successful at what she does. So I can't really be mad at her. But nonetheless, this isn't a video about my personal opinion of her comedy. She's going viral right now after receiving backlash for saying trans women aren't real women. Now, I think this entire conversation started because a trans woman said that having a period doesn't make you a quote unquote real woman. And just hilarious, being born a woman, she had a problem with a trans woman dictating what's determined as a real woman. You see how ironic that is? And ever since then, the trans community, LGB, uh, TQ community, all of them, right? They've been going off on her. Say she's transphobic, et cetera, et cetera. How dare you say people who's trans have mental illnesses? The whole nine yards. And you know what? Even though I'm not a fan of uh, Jess Hilarious, I think she's 100% correct. And also, she shouldn't be shunned upon for not wanting legally born men to determine what's a real woman or not. Because just like the example the trans woman gave, right? Periods. There's something real women got to deal with every month. Giving birth. That's a pain that real women have to go through. I know y'all hate to admit it because this is 2023. But it is a difference, man. And there's nothing against the trans community. Do your thing. I think everybody should be able to live how they want to live. But when you start trying to hijack other people's gender, cut it out. Like, I don't think y'all understand what's going on. Like, y'all are literally forcing women to address themselves as something different like seriously no disrespect but what is a cis woman no it's a woman did y'all ask women how they feel about not even being able to call themselves women anymore like they're urging health professionals to call women's private areas bonus holes like you know how degrading that is it's getting to the point where they can't even say they have a vagina anymore it's getting called a bonus hole. So yeah, Jess Hilarious has every right to be frustrated with a trans woman trying to dictate what a real woman is. I mean, eventually, women not going to even have sports anymore because trans women going to uh, run them out the gym. Because at the end of the day, they were born men. They're going to be stronger. They're going to be faster. Once they allow trans women into the WNBA, they're going to be dunking all over them women, man. Seriously. And man, I'm sorry. I could just understand uh, women's frustration right now. It's like everything is getting taken from them. Now to the point where having a period doesn't make you a woman. Insane. And again, it has nothing to do with transphobia. Ultimately, I just think it's a, a respect thing. Women fought so hard for all of these rights, etc. Just for all of this to start happening now. But in conclusion, I will say this. Don't blame the trans women. They doing what they supposed to do. They were invited with open arms into womanhood by all other women, and now they want that eagle spot at the table. And what I mean by that, this is kind of what women created. Y'all welcomed this with open arms. It wasn't men. If it was up to men, this wouldn't happen at all. But the problem is, now it's gotten too far. You see, once you get someone an inch, they're going to want a mile. And this is the perfect example. In conclusion, don't let this situation determine your perspective on all trans women or the trans community, LGBT community in general. Because even some of them are saying this is ridiculous. It's just like every other demographic. Got a few rotten apples in the bunk. But how do y'all feel about this? Especially women. I would definitely love to hear y'all comments down below. Like, do y'all feel disrespected by any of this? Is it okay? I'm genuinely curious. Are trans women, hey. Did I get it wrong? Feel free to leave your uh, opinions down below as well. But that's it for this video. Like, subscribe. I'll catch y'all on the next one. I'm gone.